Hello guys, it is Jem from Change Your Gaming here and today I'm bringing you the first episode um, of Recon, of how to play as Recon and I made this episode a kind of fast paced sniper so um, you'll see uh, some quick scoping gameplay uh, with the SV-98 Sniper Skyer Sniper Rifle secondary is the MP443 Karaj and yes as I said before um, this is this is no gameplay um, how you should normally use the recon it is only for me personally because um, I like quick scoping a lot and maybe these tips uh, help you out if you're in a sticky uh, situation like close quarter combat uh, with a sniper so yes sit back and enjoy so um, in this clip right here I'm using the SV-98 with an ACOG and I think the ACOG um, is better in Battlefield than in uh, all CODs I think except uh, in COD 4 um, because in Battlefield the, a the ACOG scope um, has no idle sway so it doesn't bounce and swing around and that's pretty pretty helpful for quick scope man long scope as you can see in this example so it stays uh, at, at its place it's, it's really nice and um, it seems like in battlefield uh, whenever you quick scope or no scope especially um, you can't get hit markers <laughs> I don't know if um, it's the same uh, with you guys but um, I only gotten one hit marker I think uh, one no scope hit marker and uh, even without magnum ammo so um, I don't know and if you snipe quickly uh, so if you quick scope um, I um, don't get hit markers uh, too so it's pretty pretty cool I think so um, because hit markers can fuck up your whole day and uh, here I'm doing some long shot and um, I don't like the Sniper Skyer scope very well because I like the cross uh, more uh, because then I can um, see um, better uh, where the bullet goes because of the bullet drop and it's more helpful for me but I don't know it's just personal um, but um, the Sniper Sky the SV-98 is a really good sniper rifle it has um, good damage, uh, it reloads, or oh, the bolt action animation is quick, and right here I go on a nice streak, I think. And um, this is a good example, don't be afraid to whip out your pistol or your secondary, yes it is a pistol, <laughs> and don't be afraid of using that. So this normally should have been hit marker because I shot him in the foot but I got a kill though. I think that's pretty good if Battlefield uh, or if DICE uh, made it that you can't get hit markers or you get more damage on the person uh, when you no scope, uh, that would be pretty, pretty insane cool. So <clears throat> maybe, I don't know, I, I can look it up and maybe write in the description um, if they made it so. Yes, and. Don't be afraid to use your pistol because this is a good example. If I would have reloaded uh, the bolt uh, or the sniper rifle, so put another bullet uh, into the. Wood. It's not chamber, but chamber's magazine. Okay, though it's it's it, it is chamber. Yes, it is chamber. <laughs> I'm sorry. Um, I would have died 90% um, because this guy was a medic. And I think uh, it was the guy uh, who was using um, the was the, was the hit marker. No, I think this was a grenade hit marker because yes, I think so. And yes, this was a guy with medic magnum ammo, and I definitely would have died. So I whipped out my pistol and got the kill. Uh, don't be afraid. No one calls you a noob uh, only because you whip out your pistol. Another example. He shot at me and then I whipped on my pistol and killed him. So, yes, um, and also don't be afraid to throw motion sensors. It helps you out really tremendously 
and also use mortar strikes and C4 if you see a tank and just place and recon and spot spotting is really really helpful for your team and for you um, you can spot uh, enemies by pressing select on playstation and i think back on the xbox for pc it is i don't know i think c or q or anything along those lines i don't know i don't play pc, PC so Yes, this wraps up this commentary, so my name is Jem, and I hope this tip can help you next time, or episode 2 will be long range sniping, and yes, see you next time guys, please rate this video, whatever you feel it deserves, and goodbye.